G'day everyone, Akadaka Stacker, and today we're just going to go over my March 2023 collection, what I've managed to get this month, okay, in layman's terms. So, without further ado, let's get on with it. Right, first up, first of March was six. Now it's gotten very late for me because there's people mowing lawns and doing all sorts of shit out here, making a racket. So I've got six of these. We slippery little suckers. Okay. Sorry about that koala bear. It became a drop there. Right, yeah, next one up was two Robin Hoods. I just got a face in the right way because it's an antique coin and he's a bit hard to see sometimes. Okay, two of these. Really, really nice. Next up was one of these. You're gonna focus, this is too shiny. There we go. Okay, one of them. Uh, next up was, okay, now According to the dates in my ledger, it says that the day that I got this was the, the, the day that I traded those five one kilo AG bars at Swan Bullion and swapped it for one five kilo bar, the, that big ass ABC five kilo bar. All right, that's only, but I didn't buy them five kilos in March, okay? So, I'm just doing what the book says. All right. Next was two. Cougarans. You're all familiar with them? No point working around on those. Next was. Where is it? Two. I've got the wrong stack there. Oh, yep, yeah. hang on, wait. Two Maid Marians. All right, we'll do these two like this because it's actually like this. Okay, so I've got a Robin Hood and a Maid Marian in this little fancy ass box thing that I got from Cash Generator when I bought something else. So there's another Robin Hood. Come on. Okay. Another Robin Hood and Maid Marion. Yeah, she's very shiny. And because it's a bit late now, I don't have all the natural light. The camera tends to freak out a bit. Okay, Maid Marion. I'll just get them ones out of the way. Two Noah's Arcs. Just stack them on top of the Grugarans. From Armenia. Okay, next up. Oh, next up would have been. Oh, and I'm very pissed off and disappointed about this because when I got these, these things were beautiful. All right, two Canadian maple leaves which have gone to milk. Yeah, thank you, Canada. Beautiful. What I thought was a fucking lovely coin. Now it's just turned to milk. I'm going to have to 
bust that cap open and give it a good old treatment with see if it will come off it should come off with uh, that shaving cream so la di da going through my list right next up was is sorry a five ounce year of the rabbit big round coin next up was three skippies well, I won't bother showing that because they show up again very soon and I've got one out of the capsule to show you alright we've done the robin hoods which were these ones here according to the list the next one on the list my nice big 10 Oz American flag bar very very nice I like him over there right yeah next up after that was two Philharmonics So I'd show it upside down. These are actually quite nice, really. Alright, not much. Everybody knows them. Right. So, the next thing was what was this? An Iron Maiden fan club guitar with this home of the free because of the brave and because of this nice two ounce. American Eagle and because of this this lot here was my gore winnings from good old conscious stacker so it gets its pride in place as a unit over here okay thank you conscious now I am endeavoring to find capsules for those all right the next was campaign for liberty ron paul yeah with a big ass scratch out rescued it from a pawnbroker but i can't do anything about the scratch okay this was a part of my american week when um Everything was American. See, so if I spend that, and these, and this. So, what's next? Ah, once again, more than likely American, but um, a new world order with a big R scratch in it. This is the one that was covered in milk that I cleaned up with the shaving cream. I mean, you couldn't have, we couldn't even, you couldn't even see that it was like a map of the earth, or you could sort of see numbers and a bit of bottom Africa and all of this was like an ice age. So the old shaving cream works, people. New World Order coin. Ugh. Mm. Alright, okay, next up is a bit of Australian constitutional, a 1954, come on camera, 
1954 Australian florin. Okay, so that's 500 silver they are. Okay, next up after that was this lovely little number. A beautiful little Perth Mint 10 gram. Very sweet. Unfortunately, it was the only gold I got for the month. Next up was two two ounce Sabre Pussycats. I actually haven't done a total on how many ounces either. So I might have to put you on pause soon. All right, what was up next? Sorry, I'm very vague today. I've been so tired all day. It's a change in the weather, mate. I tell you what, it's like as if the end of the world is coming, mate, because the wind's been blowing. It's gotten really cold. Uh, yeah, it's like all of a sudden, but Australia goes from one extreme to the next. So one day it could be, 45 degrees or a week it could be 45 degrees and then all of a sudden one day it's like we're living in the ice age there's no in between all right traveling along we have the one ounce beautiful shark coin from the sydney 2000 olympics got this in secondary silver it's actually a proof there you go wow look at that eh hitting that reflective light cool yes this was a score 37 bucks or something right, put you there jaws so after that, where am I at? One 50 cent round 50 cent 1966 and uh, it was a spur of the moment getting it and it wasn't cheap but I looked at the condition of it and out of all the ones I had to choose, this was first. This was the best one. The rest were pretty, very ordinary for the money. So, 80% silver. So, the next up was on the same day of the round 50 cent piece was two. Oh, 1954, 1954 Florins. Oh, I've got the 46 and the 54 mixed up. There we go. This way around. Is that correct? What's going on here? Yeah, that's 1946. That's the early one. So 1954. This one here appears to be in very good shape compared to this one. See the details gone on the kangaroo on this one? She's been sliding around on something. It's a bit flat there too. But these are, once again, 50%. After those, it was this big beauty
Beautiful 10 ounce. Liberty, independence, freedom. Sitting ball. And after a bit of a gander at it. Scottsdale. letting you look in silence and in awe feel that when I flick that light across his face it nearly sort of like changes very nice even I was looking at this earlier I was looking at the detail on the buffalo under the microscope well not microscope but the you know the thing that you used to burn ants with Look really, really good. It actually looks like real fur. I love this. So we're going to have to I'll stand that one up. And after that was Tim. Sorry, conscious. Ten Perth Mint, just down the road from me, twenty five minutes away. Ten skippies, and on top of that, it was at the same timing six Queensland Mint. Crowns, the ones that everybody really, really liked. Let's see if I can find a better example. Black Mirror. So that's it, guys.